Hello and a warm welcome on what is a glorious night for football. Perfect playing conditions. I'm Derek Ray, your match commentator, and alongside providing all the tactical analysis is Stuart Robson. And what we have coming up for you is live coverage of this Ligue 1 match. It's Trois against Paris Saint-Germain. Well, thanks, Derek. The best coach I played under would always tell us before kickoff, earn the right to play. If you can win your individual battles, outrun your opponent, eventually you'll get the space to show your ability. I'm sure that's being echoed by the coaches here today. And this is how the hosts will begin the game today. When you see it like that, their central midfield players look a little bit isolated. But I'm expecting the two fullbacks to push up to make it more of a 3-4-3. And I think we'll see a lot of positional rotation in this starting 11. Introducing the Paris Saint-Germain starters. Gianluigi Donnarumma is the keeper. Marquinhos plays alongside Sergio Ramos in central defence. Lionel Messi starts with Neymar in the wide positions. And lining up through the middle in attack today is Kylian Mbappe. Interesting 90 minutes ahead of us here. Paris Saint-Germain get things started. Fabian. Well, high marks for that pass. He's in with a chance. It's got to be. Saved, but still a chance. A significant block by Ramos and throwing himself at the ball. Well, the crowd know that set pieces could be their best chance. Just listen to that reaction. And there's the delivery. And a super header. It looked as though it might be going in. And increasing the pressure, another corner it is. Now sending it in. Well, off target in the end, and that'll be a goal kick. Well, I think the defender just about did enough there, but that was a chance. Well, a good place to win it back, and let's see what it leads to. Wonderful chance! Oh, he's missed, but by a minuscule margin. Well, he couldn't have made better contact than that. His technique is brilliant. He's so unlucky there. Kimpembe. Fabian. At times they make passing look easy, but then the one that goes astray. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. He continues his run. Can they forge ahead? Well, they would have done had it not been for the keeper. Well, they should be ahead now. Yes, it was a good save, Derek, but he should score from there.
And over it comes. But he can't keep that effort on target. And a goal kick it'll be. Vitor Ferreira. They've given it away. Able to skip past his man. Must be! Well, the keeper was called upon and delivered. Well, he's so good in those 1v1 moments, and he's proved it yet again. Trying to pick out a teammate. The end product just wasn't there. And well, they've won possession back. What can they do from here? Kouame. Making sure it didn't get past him. Oh, he saved it well. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Well, not the best clearance. A wonderful intervention. Kwame. Ronnie Lopez. Can he put them in front? Oh, no, he's missed the opportunity. And they remain level. Well, he just lacked composure there, didn't he? They should be ahead now. Marquinhos. Marco Verratti. And the advantage is with PSG. Still level here, but the pressure escalating. I just couldn't play that decisive ball. Textbook closing down, and now they're on the attack. Well, the keeper reacted magnificently. And Neymar. Well, PSG will count themselves unlucky not to have taken the lead there, but that was a great bit of goalkeeping. What a save that was. Well, that's a super ball over the top. Just needs to stay calm. Oh, a save of the highest order. Well, he got his angles absolutely right. What a good save that is. And the referee has caught up with him following his indiscretion earlier. Delivering it. Oh, splendid header, but a fine save. Well, this is a big moment, and don't these fans know it? <laughs> so the corner played into the box. He's lost it, and the counter looks on here, options available. Verratti must take the lead here. So half-time here, and in that first half, the two teams matching each other in most departments. How about your assessment of Paris Saint-Germain, Stuart? Well, after giving their attacking play the big build-up, they've let us down. 
They haven't quite been as fluid. The strikers haven't got the better of their markers and they've just missed a couple of chances. But I'm still sure they'll score goals in the second half. Well, they've got things going again here, and I wonder what kind of second half we have in store for us. Kwame. Really a very poor ball. Salmier, Agume might really be able to trouble them here. Surely, well, the keeper committed himself. PSG are going to switch things around on the personnel front. And taken short. And he cuts in from the wing. It's got to be! Oh, commanding goalkeeping. And increasing the pressure. Another corner it is. He's driven in the corner. Well, it came to nothing in the end. Perfect tackle. Rami. Balde. It did look on for them, but not to be. 30 minutes to go then. Ramos. Messi. How can he take them on and beat them? Well, a chance here, perhaps, to invigorate their aerial targets. They've decided that now is the time to go to the bench. Well, opting for the short corner. Lionel Messi. Messi cutting in from the flank. Tremendously strong in the tackle. Well, capable of so much better, to be honest. Well, I expected more as well, Derek. I thought from that sort of position, he had every chance of scoring. But it's a poor effort. Substitution it is for PSG. Well, as you can see from these stats, put quite simply, PSG have been excellent in their build-up play, but poor with their finishing. Hakimi. Hakimi. From a textbook interception. Space on the flank. Ronnie Lopez. Well, it looked highly promising, but they got nothing out of it. A quarter of an hour remaining here. And a chance for him on the flank. Neymar preferring the inside route. And a decent save for credit.
And a creative look about this. Element of risk there, but he's won the ball. PSG on the attack as the minutes tick away. What can they do in the closing phase? Oh, a vital save, and it remains all even. Well, there you have it. He may just have saved his team here. And they will make the change now. It's a short corner. Lionel Messi. And he cuts inside. Sanchez. Now Verratti. Can they forge ahead? Yes is the answer, and that could be oh so important. Well, just look how he holds off the defender. He keeps his balance and he still hits the target. What a good goal that is. A big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Mama Balde. An unforced error, you've got to say. Well, taking into account all the stoppages, three minutes to be added on. Can he finish them off? He's done it! What a climax to this game! Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace in transition. They're so quick to get out from the back, and Mbappe just hits it with such confidence. He strikes it so cleanly. It's a great goal. So, 2-0 now. And that will be all. Three points for PSG. That's the good news for their fans around the world. Your assessment? Well, as I keep saying, if you make forward runs and you look to pass the ball forward and have players who can dribble past defenders, you're always going to carry a threat. And that's what they're doing at the moment. Their forward play was scintillating.